Smear is now at an age where he should be leaving. Um, obviously in the wild, he would leave at about this age, he would go off to find his own females. Both him and Beatrice are starting to get a wee bit boisterous as well, so it is time for him to go. Well, I mean, all animals, not just rhinos, have their own stud bookkeeper, um, and it's like a bit of like a dating system for animals, where the um, person matches up the animals that are compatible with each other, so they're not closely related. And this happens worldwide. This is not just Edinburgh here, but there's all, all zoos have stud bookkeepers. Uh, Bertus, at the moment, he's still wandering around, um, obviously looking for some air. But um, he will settle down and he'll, he'll get plenty of um, attention from his keepers. And, um, and again, he, he would be solitary in the wild and it is something that would happen. Um, so, but yeah, better shall be fine. I mean, it is sad and happy. I mean, we've all worked with Samir for um, six years and I've got a special bond with Samir because we did the training with him. Uh, myself and Leah and some of the other keepers. Uh, so it is quite hard to say goodbye to him, but we know it's time for Samir to go and he'll be well looked after when he's born and it's really happy the fact that he's going to meet a female and hopefully meet babies. <laughs>